I don't know that. <laughs> you guys, I haven't done one of these in a while, but this time we are doing this live. Not of me thinking of what I'm about to say. This is a real true review, try on, haul. But most importantly, welcome to Stylist or Stylish Fridays where I talk about brands to see if they're stylish or are they stylist. So this company is going to talk. This company is, I don't even know. It just randomly popped up on my Instagram, but let's, let's get to the intro, whatever, whatever. Why is no one ready? What's up everybody, this is your girl Baraka McKen. I simply keep a chic over here and today we are actually doing a first real true live stylist or stylish Fridays where I look at brands, talk about them. I have my little list, I'll put that right here somewhere. And we're gonna be talking about the different things, but this time it's gonna be live and I'm gonna do the try on. I'm gonna do everything that I'll be talking about because it's, it's one thing to have an opinion, you know, to do it as far as reaction and then think about what to say you guys but this is a brand where i literally look just it just popped okay so you know on instagram where they have the little ads and stuff right so it was a pay that and it got me because i like seeing i like seeing chic things or things that i know that if it has plus size and it's like an elevated look or something that I like. For me, I feel like it's a lot of brands that's not, it's not cutting it for me anymore. I don't know if it's because I'm getting older. I don't know if it's because my style is changing or elevating, but um, it's, yeah, I don't know. But anyway, I love the packaging. Y'all already know how I feel about packaging. It has a cuss word on it, so just FYI, but I'm a cover up. It says, I'm here, B word, first off. That's hilarious. But let me get into what it's about because I wanna say they have a, a real true message. So, as soon as you get on it, it is called finesse.us. So, you know, you get the little points, whatever, whatever. You know, get your little 10%. So it's called, a, so this little collection is called Allure. And you know, it's just cute, little simple. So I gotta, I, I, I'm gonna show y'all what I got. So it's sort of like futuristic, chic cosplay. Like, I, you know, little uh, Y2K or whatever you call the little style, the early 2000s is what I'm calling it because that's what we wore. So um, just going through the website, like, you know, little cute things. Like this is honestly a really cute dress this one right here um i'm just sort of i'm just still sort of nervous to get it because i don't want it to look too cheap you know what i mean like if it was like that like straight black that would have been everything but when i see it on here i'm like mm -mm. i'm like oh them straights look but let's go to about there we go Okay, so I literally just, mind you, I literally just went on a whim and bought this. I didn't check out like why, who they are, you know, all this other stuff. I just saw some cute clothes. I saw my size and I was like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna check them out. So, welcome to the future of fashion. Like I said, all of this is really live right now. So me, what I'm saying is literally wrong. AI driven. We use AI to design the secrets to you vote for what we produce. Size inclusive. We produce clothes. Pro Wait, what? We produce product for all baddies to extra smart at 3x. Sustainable. We only produce what you vote for. No overproduction, no waste. The future of fashion. The earth has suffered long enough for rampant, rampant overproduction and wasteful assembling. As the first AI driven fashion house, Finesse leveraged a series. Oh my God. AI tricked me. AI convinced me. You know how to feel about that. I like it, but. 
interesting. Wow. Shut up. So you can vote. I actually want to dress like this. Don't, I don't know why, but it's just the middle part. I just, I don't know. I'm voting for it. Damn, 75, 79. Yup. People know what time it is, because that's a cute ass dress. Okay, 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 okay. This is even more intriguing. So, not only this is a brand new fashion brand, this is an AI driven fashion house. So AI just basically, y'all used my cookies and y'all basically like yeah we got her we got her and y'all got me <laughs> got him we got him <laughs> but i'm scared because now that i know this is ai driven what if the pants don't fit right that's scary but that's interesting uh okay so website that's still dope. So it's AI, but y'all have women and um, LGBTQ leadership and people working there. That's really dope. I really like it. Very feminine. I'm here for it. Originality. Like, I'm sorry. That that That's it, it, that's a 10 out of 10. We're going to see how this... We're going to see all of this. But, okay. Originality, that's actually really dope. You, like, you're coming up with these ideas, these designs and your consumer votes for what's being sold. Like, that is, that's genius. Like, that's actually very genius. 10 out of 10 for me. We about to get to this quality of clothing. So yeah, let's, okay, let's skip all of that because we'll go back to it. Shopping experience. It was very fun and I actually enjoyed on the website it was actually very like i don't know it was this really dope it was very chic you know what i mean all that good jazz the shipping the box i only got three items here for it so the thing is the models on the website what i like about it is so you have the 3d ai um you know picture of the item and then they actually put the item what it looks like on an actual figure which I actually do appreciate so it lets me know like I do like it but do I truly like it if that makes sense because you can like something but then when you see it on an actual in the real light of a, how it looks on the individual it's a difference compared to it looking like an airbrush um, editorial because at the end of the day it can be like oh that's cute but I still don't know if that's really truly cute on me or not ASOS and stuff like that they show a video of how it actually truly looks how does it move how does it like does it stick to you when you walk and you see the fabric the quality of it it, it can go deeper and deeper but um I still don't want to get everything. The return policy, I haven't got to that part yet, but we'll see after I try this stuff on. Oh my God, I'm so nervous. This is very, very new for me. Okay, anything else in here? No, okay. Wait, what did it say? Don't worry about me, baby. I'm recyclable. <laughs> That's cute. They come in the little baggies. I don't know if you can see, I already said high maintenance on this little shirt. We're going to see if it's cute or not. Um, I got this in a 2X. Like I said, we, we, we doing all this again. So this is like a basic white shirt. I don't know why. I just was trying to get the free shipping. I got this in a 3X. Hopefully it's not too big. And then this is the real reason why I, I went to the website. These pants is what caught my attention. I got this in a 2X. So hopefully it fits. And um, they're a pair of pants. So, we're about to try these on. So, be right back. It was even no point of me showing y'all that. Because the pants didn't fit. No type of stretch. But they are so freaking cute. That is a type of 2X that I can't get into. Because there's literally no give in them at all. Real true cargo like pants. And I'm just like... Anyway, the other top, it was too small. I was putting it on, it literally was like right above my boobs. I was like, nah, that ain't it. 
and I had another white shirt. It was just the it's just a rib crop top. It was no point of wearing it, showing y'all that. That was um, as you can tell by my disappointment. <laughs> I was like, okay, okay, AI got me, AI got me. The quality of the clothes, the only thing I can say that was actually real good quality, personally for me, was the white rib crop. We're finna rate the return policy now. Because I'm like, ah, ee. oh, here we go, start. That took too long to find. Returns and say, don't worry, we got you. Okay, let's see, okay. Order number. Okay, so on here it says returnable until August 24, 2023. That's honestly a long time. Choose your items to return. Ooh, I like that option. And then cargo. I like this. Now that I finally navigated through all of that, I like the return process because each item that I had a problem with, I was like, I, I, I like, I wonder if I can just exchange or is it one of those websites that I hate that you have to return? And like, I've always felt like if it's, if you just needed a different size, like I feel like I shouldn't have to just, I feel like I can return, I can exchange, you know what I mean? I shouldn't have to return and then buy again. I don't, I don't, it, that doesn't make sense to me. The shirt that was just too small, I was just like, eh, I don't really do too much care for it anyways. So I was like, I'ma just get, it had an option to give me store credit for that particular item, right? You have an option, return exchange. The pants, I love the pants so much. Like I said, I wish I can get a bigger size. I exchanged that. So I returned that and I'm exchanging that. And so what I'm doing is I'm going, they sent me a label. I'm gonna pack it up. They said I can reuse the bag. Hello. Come on now. You can't get too much better than that. So for this brand called Finesse or Finesse, um, I'm sorry if I'm jumbling it. Hopefully one day I hear it. So that is the question, right? Are they stylish or stylists? I wanna say thank y'all and hi, new followers. But anyway, thank you guys for watching as my battery dies. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye.